Hey everyone, I wanna to talk to you today about forgiveness. What, forgiveness? Yeah, it's something that is so hard for us. But I wanna give you a definition. It says, forgiveness is often defined as an individual, voluntary internal process of letting go of feelings and thoughts of resentment, bitterness, anger, and the need for vengeance and retribution towards someone we believe has wronged us, including ourselves and God. And for 10 years, I just kind of want to give you a backstory of how I gave this revelation, how I came to this revelation of forgiveness. For 10 years, I held, you know, coming to Christ, you, God starts peeling away the stuff in your heart. He starts, it's a relationship with him. He starts saying, hey, this is the part you need to let go. This is the part you need to change. And for 10 years, I held this thing in my heart for 10 years. And finally, probably last year in 2019, God was like, Felicia, there's unforgiveness in your heart. And it made me have resentment towards God, towards people I couldn't love properly. And I was so tired of it. I'm like, God, I just, I don't want this anymore. I don't know how to forgive. A lot, a lot of people out there are like, how do you let go? And so one day I'm in God's presence and I'm like, God, I'm tired. Please forgive me. Forgive me of my sins. Because at the time, um, I was walking with God strong for 10 years and at the time, I just, I was falling into sin. I needed forgiveness at the time and I couldn't hold it anymore. And in his presence, I felt the forgiveness that God gave me that I didn't deserve. And in that revelation, I understood, I don't deserve forgiveness. Just like some people you might think don't deserve forgiveness, but you're able to forgive because you know how much God's forgiving you. And so I went through a whole pattern of my life and I'm like, wow, God, I have to forgive this person, I have to forgive this person. I wrote it down. I did whatever it took to forgive. I even had to confront people that were still in my life and say, I'm sorry if I've held things against you, forgive me. And God started breaking these things out of my heart. He started showing me that forgiveness, that's what we're supposed to walk in in this world. If you can walk in forgiveness, this world can be changed. Your circumstance can be changed. And so I wanna share a scripture. It's in Mark 11, 25, 26 in the Amplified, Amplified Version. It says, whenever you stand praying, if you have anything against anyone, forgive him. Drop the issue, let it go, so that your Father who is in heaven will also forgive you and your transgressions and wrongdoings against him and others. But if you don't forgive, neither will the Father in heaven forgive your transgressions. That hit me hard when I heard that because I did a lot of stuff. You know, we've done a lot of stuff and we don't deserve God's forgiveness. And so today, if you feel like, man, there's something I can't pinpoint, Analyze your heart. Go into God's presence. This is day seven. This is where God's starting to break things in your life. Analyze your heart and say, God, what are the people? What are the things? What are the events? Even sometimes we hold things against God. Lord, show me and help me process this. Let me pray for you really quick for forgiveness. Father God, I just thank you today for everyone who's watching and those who have felt like there's one thing in my heart that I just can't let go. There's one person, there's events, there's things that have happened, traumas, tragedies. Lord, those people, I just pray, God, that you show them, Father, how to let go. You show them what needs to be let go and the process of how to do it. And I thank you, Lord, that there will be freedom as they forgive because you have forgiven us, Lord. So we thank you and we praise you in Jesus' name. Amen. See you guys later.